This video gives an overview on ion torrent sequencing, another type of next generational sequencing. The ion torrent method uses the same idea as a small molecule real time sequencing, where they sequence at enzymatic rate using the DNA polymerase. Instead of having a fluorescent, they recognize that when a base is added to a DNA sequence, a hydrogen ion is released. It is that ion that the computer is able to detect and, and differentiate which base had been added to give off the ion. The whole basis is this computer chip where the sequencing is going on. While this technology uses a sequencing by synthesis method in emulsion PCR similar to other platforms, it differs in that it doesn't use fluorescence or chemiluminescence. As mentioned before, it instead measures the protons, or hydrogen ions, released during base incorporation. The lack of any optics has allowed ion torrent to rapidly expand the output from their systems by operating tenfold every six months. This rapid pace of improvement, along with fast runs of about two hours and inexpensive consumables, has made ion torrent a popular new platform. The first step in the workflow is library construction. While there are a number of options available, the process is fairly standard and generally involves taking DNA, or RNA converted to cDNA, fragmenting it into uniform size, generally about 200 to 400 base pairs, and then adding sequencing adapters. Ion Torrent has specific kits for a variety of applications, including DNA fragmentations for small genomes, to total RNA sequencing and cancer-specific targeting sequencing. The fragments generated during the library preparation are attached to beads and amplified using emulsion PCR. Beads coated with complementary primers are mixed with a dilute aqueous solution containing the fragments to be sequenced along with the necessary PCR reagents. This solution is then mixed with oil to form an emulsion of micro droplets. The concentration of beads and fragment is kept low enough such that each micro droplet contains only one of each fragment. Clonal amplification of each fragment is then performed within the micro droplets. Following amplification, the emulsion is broken and the amplified beads are enriched in a glycerol gradient. There is a video available that explains in greater detail how emulsion PCR works. What really differentiates Ion Torrance's system is the sequencing technology. It is based on the standard pyrosequencing chem chemistry, a form of sequencing by synthesis, whereby individual bases are introduced one at a time and incorporated by DNA polymerase. However, unlike other platforms, rather than measuring light release from chemiluminescence reagents, the Ion Torrance system measures the direct release of the proton, or hydrogen atom, from the reaction. Because optics aren't required, they are able to make relatively inexpensive instruments cou coupled with disposable chips, which essentially act as pH meters. The lack of optics also means that they don't have to contend with slow image scans, so the sequence reaction can be relatively fast, with 200 base pair long reads taking about two hours. Finally, the lack of fluorescence or chemiluminescence means that the system can be used unmodified nucleotides, which are cheaper and better tolerated. Finally, the lack of fluorescence and chemiluminescence means that the system can use unmodified nucleotides, which are cheaper and better tolerated by DNA polymerase, leading to a more efficient sequencing base. While the error rates are generally pretty good, about 1%. Pyrosequencing chemistry has trouble with long homopolymers, which are stretches of the same base. Because the chemistry doesn't pause after each base incorporation, stretches of the same base will result in a single, stronger single signal. While short stretches can be differentiated, it becomes increasingly difficult with longer stretches. As the ion torrent systems generate standard output files like FASTAQ, Data analysis is generally, is generally straightforward. In addition to a variety of available third-party analysis solutions, Ion Torrent offers the Torrent browser software, which acts as a primary interface for a number of basic functions. 
Ion Torrent has launched a cloud-based solution called Ion Reporter that will serve as a front end for a variety of open source analysis solutions. This is the work cited for this video. Here is the recommended video in order to further understand how ion torrent sequencing works. This is the last next generational sequencing video for this learning flow. Thank you for watching.